Hi, I'm Maitre Patel. I work at the Mayo Clinic in Arizona, and I'll be talking to you today about a method of analyzing heterogeneous adnexal findings in patients who present with acute pain and who are not pregnant. So I have no disclosures to make. A woman who presents to the emergency room with acute pelvic pain can have many different diagnoses that you have to consider, and ultrasound plays an important role in diagnosing most, if not all, of these conditions. Uh, the things you might consider include the gamut of GYN diseases, uh, gastrointestinal conditions, and urinary tract abnormalities in both the acute and chronic setting. It's really too much information to try to cover in one topic or one lecture, and so what I'd like to do is focus on just one specific subset of patients, and that's the patient who comes in who has acute pain, she's not pregnant, and you find something in the adnexa that's abnormal. The main differential diagnosis when you see a heterogeneously enlarged adnexal findings in patients who um, present with pelvic pain um, acutely are ovarian torsion, ovarian hemorrhage, and pelvic inflammatory disease. Now with ovarian torsion, the pathophysiology is such that there is a twist of the adnexa and specifically the ovary around a pedicle leading to lymphatic and venous congestion. And that congestion then results in a limitation and an impediment of arterial inflow. 